Hey, good evening, Steve. Good evening, Lauren. So everyone we spoke with had a similar reaction, shock and disappointment hearing about those 12 robberies that have started happening in January of this year. Matter of fact, we spoke with one mother and she says that she moved to carry for safety and now this has her thinking twice. Rain Andrews, a mother of three, says she's troubled by the recent residential break-ins here in Cary. I moved to this area because it was safe, so it's like now, you know, are these people coming from another city or I'm just really shocked. According to Cary PD, since January 2024, there have been 12 break-ins at various homes throughout the Northwest District. All these incidents taking place along NC 55 Highway and Davis Drive corridors. That's that's uh, out of this world, really. I mean, that's crazy, especially right here in this area. I wouldn't expect it. Carrie PD says thieves are breaking in during daytime and evening hours when people are not at home, and they gain access by opening rear windows and doors. Then, once inside, they steal jewelry and cash. They know what they're doing, obviously, and that's just not a good thing at all. Um, I don't know, kind of speechless about it. Carrie PD sharing these pictures from security cameras of two suspects involved, hoping someone will recognize them and call in a tip. Pictures also show a small late model blue Toyota Corolla and a blue minivan being used to get away. It's even worse that they haven't been caught yet. Yeah. Just, just a very uneasy feeling. Why do people feel the need that they have to break into people's homes? That's the real question. Now, Carrie PD tells us they are encouraging homeowners to check their back doors, to check their back windows, make sure those are locked. And if you do have a security system, be sure it's activated when you leave home. And of course, you can call PD if you have a tip and you can remain anonymous.